fetch me some leather and some lube. Hey, I got a Glock in my Rory. Hey, 17 shots, no 38. I got a Glock in my Rory. 17 shots, no 38. I'm she's fine. Wonder when she'll be mine. She walk past like crazy. There's not too many hobbies where you get to say, right, I'm going to suit up, but first, I need to get some lube. If I started a motorcycle group called Leather and Lube, would people get the wrong idea? So I tried and failed on my last time out to record some exhaust note. Uh, because I can only work with what I've got, I'm not spending any money on anything at the moment. I tried using a plastic bottle and I chopped the end off to try and keep as much rigidity as possible. It's still a little 250ml bottle. And then pointed it so that the wind would be coming over it, you know, so there would be no wind hitting the mic. And that worked. That element worked brilliantly. What didn't work was the <laughs> inevitable vibration of the plastic, which made it sound like um, a BMX on crack. Remember when you used to get a little plastic bottle, squish it up and shove it under your uh, brake caliper, rear brake caliper, I think it was? and then it would hit the tread, so when you went round it would sound like a little, <laughs> a little motorbike engine. No? Well, maybe just me. But, um, that's kind of what it sounds like, only really, really quick. I might put a little bit in. I won't subject you to a whole video of that shit. excited in the last episode, the Forza Italia episode, getting to go and take out the 800 and I realised I'd arranged it for half term when I have other plans already, which is an absolute fucking cunt nugget of a thing to happen, so I'm going to have to put it off for a little while, but that episode will be coming, I promise. Yeah, you have right of way, you have right of way, you have right of way. People are fucking retards, aren't they? I think my chain might need a little bit of tightening. Um, and I've never had to do it. Anytime it's really been checked and adjusted, it's been in the garage anyway, so... I've never had to do it. I should probably learn how to do that. Yes, I know. I should burn in hell for not knowing. Right, that's the last one of those I'm putting up with before I complain about it in a fucking vlog. What the fuck has happened since I stopped riding that these cunts have stopped nodding? What's wrong with these people? I'm not including you guys because I think, typically, anyone involved enough to be watching moto vlogs is going to be a nodder. Because I think the more you involved you are, the more part of the community you feel and you're going to be a nodder, aren't you? You just are. Do any of you not odd nod? And if you don't nod, fair enough, but can you share with me your reasons for not nodding, please? Because I don't understand. I just don't understand. I've had very few nods. Probably only... There's another one. I don't get it. What's happened? The people have stopped nodding. I don't know these people, so it's not that they're taking a personal dislike to me. So what the fuck? What's happened to this world that people will not nod? I don't understand. Could have moved forward, no, just ignore me, you fucking knobhead. <laughs> fucking idiots. <laughs> Excuse me! What do you want to do? I want to tell you, I was going to tell you your back brake lights out. Your brake light's out at the back, I noticed back there. It's yourself. <laughs> Hard life, has it been a miserable cunt? Oh, 
Look at these fucking dickhead bitch motherfuckers. Yeah, a lot of people think that I just upload, um, that I must be like the world's biggest cuntish driver causing problems and road rage all over the place. Because look at the stuff he uploads. The reason I upload it is because it's it might be worth watching half a bit, maybe. Um, if it was shit, I wouldn't bother. And that's the simple truth. A lot of me riding around is just this. It's shit, nothing happens. Why would you want to see that? Exactly, you wouldn't. So why would I upload it? Exactly, I wouldn't. Just, just stop being cunts about it. It's basically my point. I thought she was having some kind of seizure, but she wanted to hear the bike rev. Each to their own. Put the phone down. Put the phone down. Fucking wank, Steve. Just don't fucking use your phone when you're driving. No texting and driving. No fucking talking and driving. No playing music and driving. So whatever the fuck you're doing, put the fucker down. Don't look at it, don't touch it. So I did enjoy my little mini adventure down to Silverstone and I, I really should go further out of my comfort zone because whilst that's only half an hour or so away from here, um, I haven't been there really. I've been there once before, but you know, I just got on the bike and rode and it was nice. I was plodding along at 55, 60 miles an hour on the Joe Carriageway, um, you know, left hand hanging in the wind, just chilling out, enjoying it. And it was nice. Hey, someone nodded at me. Fetch me some leather and some lube. And Triple was happy.